let's begin with the clinical vignettes. So, the 30-year-old woman who died from aortic dissection due to the defective fibril one that is abundant in lens periosteum and aortic media. On examination, his eye lens is displaced upward and temporal. This man is most likely suffered from. First option is a osteogenesis imperfecta. So the what is the fibrin? Fibrin is basically the glycoprotein. It's a glycoprotein that form sheet around the elastin. So basically, this person is suffer from elastin related disorder. So what is osteogenesis imperfecta? Osteogenesis imperfecta is, is basically the brittle bone disease in which the collagen decrease type 1 collagen. So it manifests with blue sclera is a high yield stuff. Blue sclera tooth abnormalities, conductive hearing loss, and multiple fractures. Menke's disease and ehlers Danlos syndrome both are the diseases of the decreased collagen synthesis. Decreased collagen with the Menke's disease, the pathophysiology of the Menke's disease is basically Normally, the ATP7A gene is normally produced Menke's protein. So, this Menke's protein is important for the lysyl oxidase enzyme. So, this lysyl oxidase enzyme is responsible for the cross-linking of the collagen, which is necessary for the normal function of the collagen. In what happened in the Menke's disease, this gene is mutated. So what happened? The Menke's protein, Menke's protein is decreased. And what happened? This lead to the decreased lysyl oxidase activity and decreased cross-linking of the collagen. And in this way, the collagen is impaired. So Menke's disease patient present with brittle kinky hair, growth and developmental delay and hypotonia. So highly important thing related to the Menke's disease increased cerebral aneurysm. Next is the Ehlers-Danlos syndrome. So it is again that collagen related disorder in which the collagen synthesis is impaired. So presentation of the Ehlers-Danlos syndrome is hyperextensible skin, hypermobile joint, easy bruising. So the, the, the common form of the Ehlers-Danlos syndrome, hypermobility type, it is the most common type most common type of the ehler danlos syndrome. Next is the classical type in which the type 5 collagen is decreased while in the vascular type 3 collagen is decreased. So the Marfan syndrome is autosomal and dominant disorder with variable expression in which affecting, affecting organ or skeleton eye and heart. So what happened normally? This FBN gene, which is present on the chromosome 15, code fibrillin, a glycoprotein that form a sheet around elastin. So Marfan is an elastin-related disorder. So the intellect in the Marfan syndrome is a normal as compared to the homocysteine urea where the me, uh, me, patient is a mentally retard. So the most common cause of death in the Marfan syndrome is aortic dissection. 
while in case of the homocysteine urea increased risk of the thrombosis lead to the mi so mi is the most common cause of death in the homocysteine urea so the lens is dislocated upward and temporally in the marfan syndrome these the difference of the marfan syndrome and homocysteine urea are the super high yield stuff particularly the lens and the most common cause of the death so the lens dislocate downward and nasally in case of the homocysteine urea so what happen normally this homocysteine it normally convert to the cystathionine by a enzyme cystathionine synthase the cofactor of this enzyme is a vitamin b6 if vitamin b6 is deficient so this conversion homocysteine to cystathione does not take place uh, so another conversion of this homocysteine to the methionine by enzyme methionine synthase by and the cofactor of this enzyme is vitamin b12 this methionine amino acid is necessary for the protein synthesis so the right option of this ans the question of the clinical winnet is the marfan syndrome because it is the only only syndrome that is related to the elastin so the marfan syndrome is the right answer of this clinical winnet because fibrillin is defective in marfan syndrome